Hello, GB Networks here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get a Unify access point working from scratch. We will be going through how to put it on to your switch through PoE, and then we will be going over to my dashboard to show you how to adopt it. It's a pretty simple process, so it shouldn't be too long of a video, so let's get into it. All right, now that we have the camera posi positioned to a different angle, I can now finally show you how to get your access point to your PoE switch to power it up. I will say if you do not have a PoE switch, you will need a PoE injector. And by the time you're seeing this, I should hopefully have a video out on how to use a PoE injector and how to set it up. But right now, I just have my Unify Switch 860 watt that has four ports of PoE. So let's get into it. So it's a really simple process. All you do is you take your ethernet cable, I am using the Ubiquiti Ethernet cable. It allows you to bend it. It's a really nice product. It's really small. It's fl really flexible. I, I recommend it, picking some up. So just take your Ethernet cable. I'm using my Unify uh, UAP AC Pro. So this has two ports. And if you're using like a UAP C Lite, or I believe the long ranges have just one, um, just one port too. So you just do it to your main port. So you just take your ethernet cable here and you plug it in. Sometimes it's kind of hard to get it into the port, but you just plug it in there and you just find a free uh, port on your switch and you just plug it in. I'm just gonna use my um, last port just cause it's easier. And as you can see, hopefully on the switch, I'm not sure if that will go on to the camera or not, but it turned orange and it says that we have a link. And as you can see, it turns on, which means that the PoE is working to power it up. And I will also say that some of these newer access points will need PoE Plus. Um, you can look into that yourselves. It's, it's a little bit different than just regular PoE, so you can see that in a later video, hopefully. And as you can see, it is flashing white. That means it's initializing. And so now we will go onto my dashboard and we will adopt it. When it's flashing white like this, that means that it is initializing. And if you don't have it, an access point adopted yet, it will just stay white. That means it is fully ready to be adopted into your dashboard. So let's get to my dashboard. We are on my dashboard now and I will start showing you how to adopt the access point. It's pretty easy and right now as you can see I am on the classic dashboard and if this looks a little bit different if it's a di if it's the newer dashboard you can always revert back to this classic dashboard. I like the classic dashboard but anyways getting that out of the way let's go to our devices and it should turn over here quick and as you can see our UAP AC Pro is ready for adoption. So you just click here. And it's just simple as that. It'll pop up and you just click adopt. So now it says um, add a Wi-Fi network. If this is only if you do not have a Wi-Fi network um, enabled right now, which I don't. This is just my testing um, controller here. So I will add this maybe later. But as you can see, you just adopt it. You click adopt. It'll provision. And if you go back to your access point, you will see it will flash white and blue and after a couple minutes it will just stay blue this means that it is officially adopted and we will actually be right back and i will show you after it is officially adopted and it will stay blue as you can see there is no adopting or provisioning on the uap ac pro that means that is fully adopted into our controller and as you can see the memory is being used 31 percent. that means it is all good to go so we go back to our dashboard here quick and like i said it's, sometimes it's a little slow to turn over but it should say that we have one access point and it does and as you also can see we have the wi-fi traffic distribution channels all up and going and that means that you are all ready to have clients on the access point as of right now the video is done and please like subscribe if you want to and i will see you in another video